We've got Sportsnet.ca's Michael Grange joining us now. So Andrew Wiggins, one moment he's playing alongside LeBron James, the next, likely the face of the Minnesota Timberwolves. But in your latest column on Sportsnet.ca, Michael, you say that this might actually be a good thing for Canadian fans. Why? I think it's great news. One, ultimately, if Andrew Wiggins is ever going to come back to Toronto, I think it's a little easier <laughs> to get him out of Minnesota, which is arguably the coldest, maybe least desirable uh, NBA center there is. That's number one. But number two, instead of being a deferential kind of role player figure with a really good team in Cleveland, he's got to be the face of the franchise. He's going to get force fed what it means to be an NBA star and the responsibility that goes along with that. And it's almost like sink or swim time. I think for a guy as talented as Andrew Wiggins, that's actually a better situation than kind of picking and choosing his spots alongside LeBron James and Kyrie Irving and the rest. Okay, you mentioned those guys. Uh, Cleveland's offseason, not too shabby. They get LeBron back. They sign Irving long-term, and they get Kevin Love. So is this the team to beat? Is this the big three, uh, the best in the NBA? I don't know about the NBA. There are some tough teams out in the, in the West, and there's going to be some growing, growing pains. But I think this group has a better chance of being what the Boston Celtics were, remember, when they got together and won 66 games their first year than the first year with LeBron in Miami when they were not maybe a little bit shy of, of, a, of a great team. You've got a fantastic collection of offensive players. And people are going to, who maybe aren't really familiar with Kevin Love are going to realize this guy maybe, after LeBron James, is the most dynamic player in the NBA, one of the most productive, maybe the best player LeBron James has ever played with. Is it too early to predict a winner in, in this deal? Well, I, you can go both ways. I would say this. Uh, the Cleveland Cavaliers, if they're in the business of winning championships right away, adding Kevin Love was a must-do. And, and whatever it takes to get Kevin Love, I think, is a great situation, a great deal. Minnesota Timberwolves, you know you're losing your franchise player. You're going to get a number one pick, a potential superstar, another number one pick, and Anthony Bennett, who has, uh, only has upside, plus a protected first-round pick going forward. So both teams did really well. I think Cleveland Cavaliers have a better chance of getting a ring sooner as a result. So basketball fans from Canada will now drive to Minnesota instead of Cleveland. Michael Grange, 